Welcome back everyone, welcome back to our everyday living We've been very busy sorting all of this out We have three bags up top there And another one in the back besides four totes in the back here But anyway, on the uh, scrap front Still got the wash machine here that I picked up from during the week to pull apart um, We've cleaned up a little bit Still got these motors here to do like I said, I may do a video on that. Um, I mentioned that to June. It'd be nice to do a video on those. See how, how much weight I get out of them in copper, if they are copper. Like, this one here is different to that, as you can probably notice. Um, yeah, we've made some room in the shed. Made a lot of room. Got rid of all of our fridges that were way out the back over there. You can actually see the back out now. Um, we're going into an extra drum over here with our cast alloy. So uh, yeah, we've got the two little ones there, and uh, I've been able to sort out how I'm doing these. I've actually got two yesterday, on the shaky camera, um, stripped out a generator. And I'll tell you what, I got a fair bit out of that. I'll just show you the, co the copper that I got out of it. I'll tell you what, that's a fairly big one. Look at that size of this thing. I'm going to put it on the bench. That's huge. That is monstrous. It also had a center stator. Um, it's This is the center of that. Got a lot of copper in that. So, yeah, we've still got this to go through. And these are the ones we've sorted out where we've got to use the grinder and cut the cords and God knows what. Uh, I know that motor should not be there, but... That's where it is at the moment. That's where I chucked it. Um, we've still got a lot of fridge compressors in there. Going to strip all these motors down so we can get them with cast alloy, uh, iny alley, and all of that sort of thing there. But anyway, let's get to town. Find out how much this may be. Anyone's guess as good as mine? I suppose I got it pretty well last week on the cans. I guess 250 last week. Oh, that's how good I am on this week. Glass and cans. Mmm, don't know, don't know, don't know. But anyway, maybe 40, 40, 80, blah, blah, blah. I reckon only 150 bucks. No, $150 is good enough for me. Um, but yeah, anyway, we'll get to town. Go down here, the cleaner's just finished cleaning, he's gonna take his photos and god knows what else. Hope he leaves that one there. Um, Cause we'll need that. Anyway, June's starting over there on the glass. I'm gonna start right here. He took it away. He took it away. Oh well. June will have to go chasing for it. When she's finished the car.
Turn back to that signal. Here we go. We're ready to rock and roll again. Let's go.
any more in the bags? No. That's it. Well, you want to put this through there. Yeah. You might as well put it through there. It just don't go through. <laughs> I told you it didn't go through. That won't go through. It rejects it. It rejects it. Well, we're going to find out how much it cost. Well, not cost, how much we got. Not too bad, not too shabby. I reckon we went a bit over my estimation. Probably by, mm, was it? Do, 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 I reckon 20 bucks. That's just my guess. But anyway, let's have a look what we got. We got $179.50. Wasn't expecting that much. Doesn't, doesn't never, ever look like that much when you put it on a ute like that. You know, you've seen the load in the video. It was a mountain. But anyway, uh, if you've come this far in this video, everyone, don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you wish to subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell. That way you get notified when we put a new video out. So till next time everyone, happy dumpster diving, happy scrapping, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio!